Can someone tell this guy to get the camera off me? Okay. Follow me around everywhere. I'm just playing around. When you look back on 10 years, that means hundreds of players have come through and everybody has played a part in making this show what it is. But there's always gonna be players that stand out. Light them up, light them up. Yeah, nice hit. That's solid. Juice. That's solid. And that feels beyond. Siller was always pushing the envelope. You never knew what he was going to do. I'm going to run you right the f over. You're not even going to see it coming. If there wasn't any footage from that game, I still would have remembered a lot of it. I'm going to run you. I'm just waiting for my shift. That's the kind of energy that Siller brought. I'll go, you. Yeah? I'll f up the other side. He made his presence felt, that's for sure. I think I was going to kill me. <laughs> These guys are what hockey's about. Glasser, was your flight late, buddy? Well, don't forget, boys, look at them in the eyes. Tell them to go f themselves. Max, he was part of the agitator crew that really got things going. That's a pen in this league? Yep. Holy f You reffing ping pong now? Ryan Reeves, Brandon Panov. Hey, get out there, Sheriff. Get out there, you loser. And I mean, legendary. I would be remiss if I didn't mention Patrick Hornquist. Hello, I'm Patrick Hornquist. I'll be your guys' entertainer tonight. Horn was pretty intense. Let's just uh, keep it at that. No! I'm ready! He's coming in, he's gonna be yelling, he's gonna be getting in the face of the other team. He's so f tough last f minute! My favorite is probably when he crashed the net against the Capitals and maybe came in a bit late with a stick on Holpe and just got mobbed. And he just immediately starts apologizing, like, I'm sorry, that's my bad. I was dreaming that was bad. I was dreaming of that. That was bad. <laughs> just a ball on fire, always uh, ready to go. I got a Okay, good. Thank you. In practice, he would stand in front of me, spear me, trying to get the rebounds, you know, just like it does in the game, right? <laughs> Nice, Ori. Be happy with that. That was good, Ori. You know, I think of the cup years, you know, Ian Cole. Nice. You guys know hockey players at this point. Guys like to complain about everything. Like, oh, these cameras are always in my face. It's so stupid. Like, why are we doing this? Lucky shot. I'd like to see him do it again. Who does that kid think he is, eh? It didn't really bother me, to be honest. You know, at that point, I was kind of giving the middle finger just to ruin the shot, just to be an ass. I think Benino comes to mind just because he always like to play jokes on everyone. Yeah, I sit across from Phil, lucky to, to look at that mug all day. This is yeah. not happening. Are you joking? He's an okay card player. He's probably fourth ranked at our table. What do you mean, at cards? He's nuts. Are you kidding? No. Oh. I'm the best player on the plane. Ask him. Ask him the real truth. No, no, no. Phil definitely tried the hardest and maybe cared the most, but no, he's not the best. Certainly last and definitely not least is Flower. Flower always seemed to be <laughs> chirping somebody. What a muffin! I always like to tell him that they can't score usually or uh, they suck. <laughs> Nothing! He didn't get today! I found out first him, he's quite the jokester going out for practice and I look up in the rafters and all my clothes are hanging 15, 20 feet above the ice. It's hard too, right? I skate around and I saw clothing up there and I was like, oh geez, it's, it's tough to get down, right? <laughs> it was never fully uncovered, but I think it was him. I might play the fifth on that one. <laughs> oh, snakey beauty.